You have a girlfriend or no? I'm married. You're married? Where's she at? She's gambling. She's gambling right now? <laughs> like problematically? Yes. <laughs> What's her game? Slots. Slots? Yeah. What, did you marry a hundred year old? <laughs> Honey, I got us free tickets to see a Britney Spears impersonator. <laughs> she already had dinner 12 hours ago. That's why you're getting all clawed up. Got to go home and rub her salves and creams on her. <laughs> She's crushing slots right now. Damn. You got to go pick her up afterwards? And then she's like, honey, I lost it all. $17.75. I may have dipped into the kid's college fund. <laughs> no, kids. no kids either? Yeah, you gotta spend that money on gambling, man. Chase the rush. Between that and your Asian hand job massages you always get, you guys. <laughs> Damn, dude, I was just kidding, but the crowd thinks you're getting Asian hand jobs. Whoa. Damn, we should all go pick up your wife from gambling. Let's go. Let's go. We should all just fucking... What's her name? Stephanie. Like, Stephanie, you have a problem. <laughs> I think so. Mark. <laughs> we could give everyone a name. <laughs> no kids, though. That's cool. No She's only ruining your life. <laughs> you deserve it. <laughs> what does she do for money? She works for Tesla? Uh, that's, well, what does that mean, though? She works in their solar division. In their solar division? Oh, she's like a scientist? And a degenerate gambler? That's weird. What are your two things? You're like, I'm an engineer and a part-time pedophile. <laughs> I dabble. I dabble. <laughs> I don't touch him, I just like to look. <laughs> I was just kidding, but the crowd thinks she might be a pedophile. Just so you know, their reaction was wonky. They were like... Does she let you go to strip clubs if you want to go? No. She gets mad? Yes. Why? Because you're looking at other girls naked? They don't want to fuck you. <laughs> they don't want to fuck me either. Yeah, I'm, saying, I'm not saying I, they want to fuck me. I just. Ladies, you shouldn't get jealous of guys going to strip. If you guys go into strip clubs regularly, they're not fucking him. <laughs> hey, you know who I love who comes in here? Who I'm going to fuck? That guy who comes in here and eats from the buffet every afternoon. I used to go when I was 18. As soon as I turned 18, we can go to this one in South Jersey. That's where I moved from Philly. It was called the Fantasy Show Bar, and you can go there. You remember that place, yeah? It was fucking Wednesday nights. You can go, and it was amateur night. And it was real amateur night. Some of these clubs bullshit amateur night, I've heard, but this is amateur night. First time ever on stage, full nude, butt naked. And we used to go every Wednesday because there was a pretty good shot at some point you were going to see a girl from high school where shit wasn't going so good for her <laughs> up on that stage. And man, I got to tell you, I've done a lot of fun shit in my life. I've been doing comedy 25 years. It's, you have to have fun experiences in this business to get through all the years of no money. <laughs> and I've done some pretty fun shit. I got to smoke weed with Coolio, the late great Coolio. Pretty fun. I went to a zoo in Australia with Drew Carey, the Price is Right guy, that's right. He loves hookers. He brought two of them, I swear to God. We don't cross paths, it's fine. <laughs> oh, you know Uncle Joey, Dave Couillet from Full House? I saw that guy smoke crack cocaine in Montreal, Canada, I swear to God. Or it was meth. It wasn't weed. It was in one of those tourney pipes. We do that. 
And I don't give a fuck. Tell him I told you. I'll fucking beat up Uncle Joey. I'm gonna beat him up to that Alanis Morissette song that might be about him. What have you go down on you, man? Because I ring and I bang and I hang and I gang and I gong and I gong. <clears throat> All that fun shit I've gotten to do in my life, and still, there's still nothing more fun than yelling at a stripper's real name while she's on stage. I gotta tell you, those four walls of reality crashing in at that time, it's just, it's funny. It is funny. They always give him a fake name, like, give it up for passion. And you're like, that's Joy Cooper. And she's like, what? Get the fuck out of here. What are you doing? <laughs> 